Hey, Cancers. I'm back, y'all. All right, so I've been MIA for a little minute. Y'all don't beat me up. Yeah, I've been MIA for a little minute, um, but I'm back. All right, so we're into November. All right, we just got out of a Mercury retrograde. Okay, we got a new moon. All right, so we need to hop into it. We need to see what's ahead, what's coming, what's going on. I need to check up on my cancers. All right, so let's see. Thank you, spirit guys, ancestors, and angels. Please give me a message for the cancers, please. Give me a message for cancers. Hello, water sign. All right, so let's see what's going on with my cancer. Bottom of the deck, we have the six of pentacles. All right, so, oh, all right. Somebody is giving somebody some money for sure. Either you guys are giving someone a gift or someone is gifting you, but someone is definitely like, hurry up, all right, and either give me this money or I got something to, to do that involves money, but yeah, I'm definitely getting either you're being gifted or you're gifting someone, but I'm getting like give and take when it comes to the finances, okay? Got the Ten of Pentacles, Ace of Pentacles, Six of Pentacles. Definitely in a money exchange, okay? And it looks like it's a quick uh, money exchange. So it could be like a cash app, a direct deposit hit or something. But definitely some type of quick transaction. So it looks like you guys focus could be on your finances, all right? We got a new fresh start. It looks like you're taking a leap of faith into something fresh and new, all right? Now we got the nine of wands. So this is saying, be careful. All right. Maybe you're cautious about taking this leap of faith. All right. Okay. All right, so some of you could be dealing with the Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, like yourself, Scorpio here, energy here, heavy, and Leo here, energy is heavy as well, too. Lots of cups here. So definitely you could be dealing with the water sign or you're just, you know, in your element, okay? So I see a conversation, okay, a conversation here about taking a leap of faith okay a new start a new journey possibly with the water sign pisces cancer scorpio why is the page of wands here okay the lovers okay all right could be dealing with a gemini but yes you are in your feelings oh you you dove like you just dove right in like you're just like you're all the way in like you your nose is so wide right now like you you got your nose wide open i'm getting like lovey-dovey messages you telling this person how much you care about them they're telling you how much you care they care about you like it's just like an exchange i'm getting like an even exchange here Okay, all right, I like that. Tell me more. Why is the fool here? You could be dealing with a uh, Aries or a Sagittarius. Why is the fool here? The Five of Cups. All right, so you could be looking at a situation like I need to, you know, maybe you're thinking about slowing down. Maybe you're you're overthinking a situation. Maybe you're waiting to see, you know, what other options is or if there's other offers or if this person has other options or other things going on. Um, I feel like you're afraid that you might regret it. Like you, I feel like you're falling for something. You're, you're taking something to the next level. Like you're like diving in and you're, it's like you, you want to be cautious. Like, it's like, 
oh, I want to I wanna slow this down, but damn it, I'm in deep, okay? Like, <laughs> it's like you're in really deep. And I see you not wanting to have any regrets. This could be someone that you've dealt with previously. Four of Cups. That's what I'm saying. Okay. It's like you saying, like, the last time I was disappointed. I feel like this could be someone that you've previously dealt with. Or maybe you've disappointed this person or this person disappointed you previously. So, it looks like, you know, like, dang, you know. The challenge is having your guard up. How do you guard yourself? How do you protect yourself from getting hurt? What's the nine of wands here? The king of cups. You guys, it's energy. <laughs> it's, and I see you trying to, I, I feel like you're trying to play tough. You're trying to show like, not show so much emotion or show so much, uh, you know, care. But it's like, because you don't want to, you're trying to protect yourself. I clearly see that. Okay. And I feel like you're overthinking. Okay. I feel like you're overthinking. Yeah, because it, it looks like you, I feel like you've done this before. Either, even if it's not with this situation, you've been in this a similar situation where maybe you fell too soon or maybe, you know, it, it hurt so bad that, you know, it just hurt. You know, you fall, you hurt yourself. And it's like, okay, next time I'm not going to do it that way. This time I'm not going to. Um, I want to make sure that I have on a helmet, that I have on knee pads, that I have, like, I'm trying to make sure that I'm good this time. But, because I do see where something failed, okay? And there was disagreements, possibly disagreements about money, okay? Now, I got the King of Cups and the Queen of Cups here. You guys are a match. You guys are a match, okay? So, I'm getting, like, you both feel the same way about each other. Why is the Queen of Cups here? Ten of Pentacles. That's what I'm saying. Like, I'm getting long-term, stable, um, possibly leading to marriage, or you are married to this person, or something like that. Like, this, I'm getting, like, a perfect fit. I'm getting, like... King and Queen of Cups, Ten of Ten of Pentacles, okay, stability. I feel like you've been waiting a long time for this moment, and the offer and the time is here. Yes, I definitely see that. I feel like you gave yourself some time to see um, what was going to be done. What, and I feel like for some of you, this is someone that you've dealt with previously. I feel like some of you returned or someone returned to you or you returned to someone else. Yes, Page of Pentacles. I'm getting a lot of talks about money. Like there's there's conversations about leveling up. And the level up is about your finances. I clearly see that, okay? Now with this Queen of Swords back here in the past energy... Six of Wands, yeah. You're thinking about your success. You're thinking you're going ahead, okay? You're like you're headed towards success. This was your thoughts. Like, okay, if I'm going to do this this time, it's going to be done the right way, okay? Now I see you being very, very happy, excited, having a lot of fun in the near future. Very positive. Look at this. Six of Cups. Like, I feel like you and this person are, like, connecting. I feel like if this isn't a person, if this is just a different situation, I just see you being overall happy. But I do feel like something from the past has definitely returned. And it's better this go around. Okay? I definitely see that. I see a union a reunion coming together like and it's just fun you're having a lot of fun it's, it's just a, a vibe okay why is the death card here you could be dealing with the scorpio all right the king of pentacles could be a virgo towards capricorn i see you searching for something I see you searching for something. Tell me about the King of Pentacles. Ten of 
Ten of Cups. Okay. A, a connection ended possibly with the earth sign or a finance, some finances, or maybe someone finances ended. Maybe someone quit a job. Maybe someone quit a job for their own sanity, for their own peace, for their own happiness. Maybe you decided that a situation um, that may have involved money was just not for you. It wasn't fulfilling for you. It wasn't, it wasn't making you happy. Yeah. The tower. Okay. So something out of the blue, like some, some of you may have out of the blue, quit a job, um, out of the blue, cut someone off that could have been offering you and giving you stuff. Um, you know, was being a support system to you. I feel like some of you may have cut that person or situation off. Okay, I feel like someone from your past or a situation from your past or a new opportunity, something has surfaced and this is making you feel better. Like, I feel like, I feel like this is, you're doing, walking into something new, um, walking into some, a new feeling, even if it's with someone that you're rekindling things with. I feel like the energy is new. The, the person or situation that you're dealing with is feeling very, they have the feelings here too, Ace of Cups. Like they're feeling it too. Like I said, this is a mutual thing. This is a mutual feeling. It's not, it's not like one person feels, one person feels like, you know, oh, this is my world. This is what I want to do. And the other person isn't feeling the same way. All right. Could be dealing with a Libra. But justice is balance, okay? So this person feels like, yeah, you know, I'm here to help balance this situation out. I'm here to bring justice to your situation. Look, the temperance could be dealing with Sagittarius. This person here wants to bring balance into your life. Like, they want to help balance you out. They want you to balance them out. They feel like you complete them. Like, I'm just getting a mutual feeling, okay? Whatever this is, is mutual, Okay, now I see this is a desire. This is something that you want with the Nine of Cups energy here. You want this. Maybe you want it to stay on the low. Maybe you're trying to keep it, you know, quiet. Keep it on the hush hush. Okay. Ace of Wands. But baby, it's the, the fire and the passion is so there. Um, and I feel like this is something that you wanted. You wanted to feel new again. You wanted to feel rejuvenated. You wanted to, to I feel like. This situation that you're currently in or currently about to get in is energizing you. It's giving you hope. It's giving you life. Okay. The outcome is the three of cups. Like this is a union coming together, celebrating fun, drinks, popping bottles. Like it's a good vibe. It's a vibe. It's for sure, for sure a vibe. And I'm loving this energy for you guys. Look at this. Flirting, I'm getting a lot of flirting going on. I'm getting uh working together, manifesting. Like I see you building something, making something work. Okay, and I'm I'm really, really enjoying this energy for you guys. You guys deserve this. Okay, tell me more about this page of cups. Um, the four of wands and the emperor. Is this husband energy? I'm getting man of the house business owner oh i see you taking things to another level with somebody or in a situation a business the magician the the emperor and the four of wands that's huge that's big that is big i'm getting like husband energy like, this person has potential to be your husband, or you have potential to be someone's husband. Like, I'm seeing this be big. Look at, didn't I say, marriage, the Hierophant. I'm getting a marriage. I'm getting, this person could be the one. Somebody's willing to make the changes. Somebody's willing to make some changes. Somebody's willing to get rid of their toxic ways for a marriage. This is beautiful. This is very, very beautiful energy. This is beautiful energy. Look at this. Look at this. 
your confidence is back. Like you've gained your confidence. So I feel like some of you may have lost your confidence um, because of, of of the way things were going previously. And okay, you you it may have bruised your ego, bruised you a little bit. But look at this: the Ace of Pentacles and the Two of Cups, power couple. I'm digging this. I am digging this. I'm digging this. Like, this is beautiful. This is beautiful. Like, there's a beautiful opportunity here um, for you guys, Cancer. All right. So, you guys, keep this up. I love this energy for you guys, okay? If you're interested in booking a personal, be sure to contact me. My information is in the drop box below. I am running a special for my new clients. So if you, if this is your first time reaching out to me in regards to a reading, you will get a discounted rate. Okay. Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. I want to know what's going on. This is beautiful. Like, I want to know what's going on with you guys. Comment below. Share with your family and your friends. If you're new, go ahead and click that bell to subscribe. All right. So until next time, my loves, a child for now.